Gallery 5004 in Robbinsdale is dedicated to spotlighting Minnesota artists, and this month, the works of Hugh Capel are on display. He was born in um, Berlin, Germany uh, in 1910. And he was born to a, a fairly well-to-do Jewish family. Capel got a degree in philosophy in Germany before chasing his first love, art. But from there he went, in 1934, he went to Paris, France, where a lot of people went to get a good art education because that was kind of the epicenter. While in France, Capel ran with a pretty heady crowd. He was actually showing in some very prestigious galleries at that time with the likes of Picasso and Chagall and Hugh Capel. But as the 1930s wore on, things in Europe deteriorated, especially for Jews. So he moved to New York City in 1938, and he was there for the next 20 years. Well, guess what happened in New York City in the 1940s and the 1950s? It was the biggest art movement of the 20th century called Abstract Expressionism which Capel embraced. But by now, you may wonder, where's the Minnesota connection? Minnesota may have been the solution to his wife's urging to seek financial security. He wanted a regular paycheck. Uh, so in 1958, he came to Minneapolis and took a job at what was called then the Minneapolis School of Art. It's now called the uh, MCAD, the Minneapolis College of Art and Design. And he taught there for the rest of his life, uh, and he kind of passed away unexpectedly in 1982. On display are Capel's works in acrylic, oil, watercolor, and collage. If you can't make it out to the gallery, all of the works will be posted online. Although you may not ever be able to own an original Picasso, Pollock, or Hans Hoffman, you can own an original Hugh Capel, who was right there with those guys. And coming by to look is always free. In Robbinsdale, Neil Persley, CCX News. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.